Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading. So today's reading, I'm going to be doing the tarot cards. So let's dive in and see what is in store for you then. What's in store for Gemini? Reverse temperance. So there is to be some imbalance here. There is to be some self-indulgence clashing with someone here. I feel like also there may be some recklessness. Ten of Wands. So there is something that is weighing on your shoulders. There is to be some burdens. And I feel like you're going to be overloaded with a lot of responsibilities, a lot of stress, problems. Um... And you may be feeling a little bit restricted at this time. And I feel like you may also be taken for granted as well. Four of Wands. Your hope is happy. There may be someone that is coming home to you. There is a sense of a happy family being seen here. There may be a celebration, surprise, a party, a wedding or an event that is coming in for you. Um, there may also be some teamwork that you may be involved with here. Okay, reverse strengths okay so there is to be having some self-doubts within yourself um this is due to having a low self-esteem and i feel like this is putting quite a lot of pressure on yourself there is a lot of lack of confidence that you have as well Four of Swords then, so there is the sense of having some rest, rejuvenating, but there may also be some fears that you have, some anxieties and stress. You may also feel like you're overwhelmed, there's a lot of things that you got to do or you're involved with and you just need that peace and quiet, you just need that sense of rest, recuperation. Okay, reverse magician. There is to be some form of manipulation, deception, or cunning, or being cunning. Um, but also there may be some trickery that is coming in here as well. Reverse chariot. There is the sense of forcefulness. Um, a lack of self-control or being very aggressive. Reverse Page of Cups. Okay, so there may be something coming in to do with some bad news coming in for some of you there may be something to do with some childhood issues or issues regarding a child 
or there is to be finding out about some type of sexual abuse that have been going on. Okay, reverse. Reverse Eight of Swords. There is a sense of releasing, taking back control, escaping from a situation and having some freedom. I'm getting here, this could be just at least for like 1%. Finding out about some type of sexual abuse and trying to seek that freedom or you going to be finding out about some some child or someone that's pretty young that they had sexual abuse and you trying to um get them to escape and get them out of that situation trying to release them from um from that atmosphere But in general, there is the sense of releasing yourself, taking your taking back control of yourself, um, and also some bad news that's to come in. Okay, Knight of Wands. There is someone that's coming in that's very energetic, very open-minded. Um, when you see them, you feel that attraction to them. They they feel um, to you. They will feel as if they come across as very flirtatious, um, confident. Excuse me, I had to sneeze. <laughs> oh, okay, so this person's very adventurous, very flirtatious. They seem very, very charming as well. There's a lot of passion coming in with this person. Reverse Seven of Pentacles. So there's to be a situation or something that you haven't started or you haven't finished. Um, that you're going to be starting so something that you haven't finished you're going to be finishing um, and I feel like for some of you you may be involved with some type of bad business or there is a lot of financial difficulties that you may endure Ace of Pentacles there is to be a new beginning coming in there is to be finances coming in um, there, you may be um, doing some savings, um, saving at this time. Okay, four of pentacles. So you may be holding on to someone or something a bit too tight. You need to loosen your grip with something. I feel like they may be... Um, you may be having some deep-rooted issues that may be brought up at this time. I feel like there is this sense of either you may be involved with hoarding, hoarding too much stuff and you need to just get rid of it. Some of you, there is stinginess, having too much control over a personal situation, um, or there is too much possessiveness, you know. You may be in a situation where someone has taken, like, possessing you too much, like taking control, um, and then you need, need to back off, sort of thing. Or you you're too possessive over someone. Okay then, Gemini. So that is what I have for you. If you enjoyed this and this resonates, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell and I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.